Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all the Cancers and Moon Horizon. It is the first week of August 2017 and the um, reading is from July 1st until August 6th. This is wonderful. It's a word a week from the Temperance, which is the Earth Energy. And then, have, then we have the Energy Vibration of uh, um, the fire energies so you have earth and fire which is good bringing balance cleansing but we had still bringing balance so, um, it is a week of um, for you guys the night of starver so uh, message is coming in this night of starver is bringing clarity to you whatsoever is happening this night of starver is bringing clarity to you so there is someone this night is bringing clarity to you and and moving you also in a good positive direction whatever is happening know that this man is going to bring you clarity you can says whoever this person is this night of starving they're going to bring you um, clarity to a situation um, that has happened okay looking at um, your week Looking at your week, the ones it's all about work in this week. Work, work, work. There's a lot of messages coming in, and it's all about work. The knights and the kings are here. Wow. Mm. Wow. The five. Number five is going to be your energy in this week. Number five. Five and four. Fifty-four and forty-four. Uh, and um, forty-five. So, here we go. It's four or five. A fifty-five, fifty-four. 44 and 45 okay now let's look at this week this week is a week where there's absolutely no major arcanas or no there's no major arcanas uh, but you have uh, the night of uh, um, the night of Stava night of ones and the ace of ones so uh, new beginnings are coming in let's go forward and look at your week we have the four the four of ones so this is a good foundation you're starting the week off building a good foundation and this is going to be good for you cancers because whatever has happened you are protecting yourself and you're starting over and trying to build a strong foundation in your life in this week and you know this is good no matter however you look at it because whatever is happening is that the situation that you're trying to bring back stability in your life is going to be in the first day of the week and it's going to be a fire it's fire all over so it's all about the work so you're trying to build a strong foundation in your life as we look at um tuesday it's going to be a good day for you on tuesday you have the energy of the eight of cups where the energy of the eight of cups is that you're walking away from a situation and you're taking rest whatever the situation was is you're walking away from it and you're taking rest so a lot of people will be walking away from things and they are going to look for inner peace and rest on Tuesday it's a good day for you good day as we look at your focus and overcrowning of your week you have the two of Stava, the two of Stava, and the five of swords the two of stab and the five of swords so you women are like pounding this week whatever is happening you women are pounding this week but be aware of what you do because if you think you are going to win a situation and leave someone you know if you think you're going to lie and win a situation it's not going to work out so be aware be aware of what is happening for you cancers in this week as we go forward we have the four of sword the four of sword the energy of the four of sword is here 
you need to have rest it's the second time it's coming up so you need to have rest whatever the situation is you need to have rest and leave whatever it was behind move on okay whatever you need to do is leave whatever that was behind and move on because you need to have rest and that by having rest then is the time you can leave whatever what was going on and move on you have the ace of wands whatever the situation is the ace of wands comes in and the two of wands so this is good a new beginning a new beginning and a new start is opening up so you're going to get a new beginning and new portals new opportunities are going to come in your life um, new doors of opportunities are going to be opening so this is a positive energy for you cancers whatsoever had taken place in your life uh, you have the three of one so it's all about work whatever is going on and you have uh, the knight of swords the knight of swords the three of one and knights of swords you're moving away from situation and going towards the knight of swords and knight of swords is kind of for some people moving away from them so remember what is happening to you in uh, on on Saturday because on Saturday you're going to have a connection with the um, Aries um, the Gemini's of the Librans and here is a situation that is taking place so be aware of what is happening in your life because this needs to be ill whatever the situation is five of swords come back so there's going to be a lot of conflicts a lot of people are going to have conflicts and this conflict is going to be with a king of swords whatever the situation is there's going to be a conflict with a king of swords whatever the situation comes up is going to be a conflict with a king of swords you know the energy of the king of sword is that these people always want to control your life and tell you what to do and you need to um, like set boundaries in your life so whatever is happening you guys really need to set boundaries in your life because the energy of the king of sword is someone who is a Gemini Aries or a Leo that is going to come to you I want to tell you what they want and how they want things to be done and you're going to say no you know no one has the right to tell people how to live their life it's all about work whatever the situation is is the input of work you're trying to whether you're working or you're studying whatever you're doing in your life is that you're going to have these people and this king of swords could be your father too but you know sometimes we can listen but at the end of the day we need to um, use our own um, initiative to base or changes whatever we want to change in our life okay because it's all about 55 and 44 is the angels and guides and changes coming in your life whatever that changes is it's going to be good because you have good been going through um, strange situation uh, for I think seven years now so be aware and open up for these changes that are coming in and when you do that you're going to see um, positive energies coming in so this week is going to be a week where the two of sword is the the, the two of star a door and a portal is opening up and there is going to be conflicts and you're going to be you know conflicts about what is right and what is wrong that sort of a thing so this week is going to be really a week that is going to um, bring you in a conflict in a inner conflict okay and oh you got a beautiful card but you know you really really got a beautiful card you can says let's see what is happening here you have find your true inner bliss I am following the part I love and fully align to my soul purpose. I'm following the part I love and fully align to my soul purpose. I'm following the part I love and fully align with my soul purpose. And this is good. And this is going to be extremely good. Whatever it is, you're following the bliss and you're, you know, you're tr finding the true part to your soul purpose, which is extremely good. I'm coming up and at the oracles of the wisdom to say what message would you like to tell the cancers what message is here for the cancers the truth's been told 
the truth's been told so whatever situation is going on for you cancers uh, whatever the situation is uh, the truth has been told and this is the second time I'm receiving this um, energy for today in these readings the truth have been told and honesty accepting things at face value coming out of denial the willingness to be transparent clarity of communication and this is what is happening whatever is going on and you have time to go time to go so you have the truth's been told and time to go whatever the situation whatever you were going through whatever situation that was happening in the weekend you're going to have to deal with the knight of swords and the king of swords whoever these two persons are in the weekend and whatever is happening the three of you know you're leaving behind the knight of swords there's a situation that you're you know leave behind the knights of swords and the energy of the king of swords you have to deal with on sunday and you're also dealing with the five of swords so in the weekend it's going to be conflicting weekend because the energy of the swords is the air energy so there is conflicting and you have to deal with these Aquarians Gemini or Libran people in the weekend one is between the ages of 18 or maybe 0 to, to, to 35 and the other is an older person 36 and older on Sunday be aware because whatever the situation is there there are injustice and whatever you did or whatever have been done to you you have to deal with these people and you just want to leave them behind it's as if no I just want to leave you people behind you know I'm I'm finished with it because on Thursday you're thinking whatever has happened you want to leave the past behind and build something stronger the four of swords is saying to you take some rest so leave whatever that has been holding you back behind and take some rest and I want to say to each and every person um, please like share these videos and thumbs up and um, support yourself by listening to the month videos because there's a message here in this week that whoever these Aquarians Gemini's and Libras are you need to um, heal a situation in uh, in this week it's going to affect uh, most of you okay and I'm saying namaste until next week yeah.